Hello, and thank you for joining me tonight. I go by Luna Nate, and this video is a little different from my typical ones, or at least it feels that way to me. And the focus, our intention for this Reiki session, this energy session, this relaxing <laughs> session to help you sleep, but also serve some hopefully deeper purpose for you, is to activate our higher consciousness activate or expand or get into better touch with these more, I don't want to say suppressed, but these more um, not completely in use, in use qualities that we may have in our minds, such as in, incredible intuition or um, a way of being able to process things more quickly and, and by that I mean while we're learning or studying or picking up something tapping into that innate knowledge which is in which is in us which I believe is in us and, and that we are tapped into but not always completely aware of if you'd like to receive the benefits of this session this is one that really does have a heavy emphasis on your participation in terms of setting this intention and making this request. So I'd like to set the intention with you for this session to call upon our higher consciousness, our higher self, our spirit, that part of us which is connected to all that is, and send this request very clearly that we are asking for this ability, these mental abilities, these very clear cognitive, but also um, more spiritual, more um, <laughs> mystic abilities as well, to be brought more into our focus in terms of knowing that we are able to do this stuff, knowing that if you put your mind to it, even very gently, you will see a great result knowing that you may be able to get answers from within instead of always looking for something outside of yourself to, you know, give you some kind of insight. Whatever that means to you, whatever you want from this in terms of expanding, shining some light, pulling some skills that are, <laughs> I'm picturing deep within our minds, to the forefront to make these active skills, skills that we can use throughout our day to day. have this water that I charged in the full moon, this past full moon, which was in Pisces, but it also is a moon that is reflecting the sun, which is in Virgo. So this has a really good balance of that analytical, uh, logical, very um, precise thinking, but also the energy of the moon being in Pisces, which is much more mystical and um, a little more on, on that side of, of the polar spectrum. So I'm just going to spray this around you. be the best for this type of intention for me. It just keeps coming back to clear quartz, um, but also a little different as well. So I picked out this, um, it's actually a crack your own geode, cut type of geode, with clear quartz druzy in it. I just see this as it sparkles in the light now, as these these hidden things, these hidden qualities and abilities that are in you, the 
ability to heal yourself, the ability to overcome whatever challenge you face and see your way through it, the ability to know that sometimes logic is not all you need. It certainly carries a lot of weight, but it isn't always the total like a skull <laughs> and just the hidden gems reflecting in there catching the light and shining through you also brought out this clear quartz um, point like a chunky point you can let it stand up I would like you to, if you have not yet, please do make that intention of really, I don't want to say using, you know, all of your brain, but tapping into and expanding your mind in such a way that elevates you, that elevates your way of thinking, your way of doing things, your abilities and skills and skill set, your overcoming of obstacles and anything that you would like to bring into your life, see that you have or intend that you have and see that you have that brain <laughs> or that ability. So we begin this session Some Reiki symbols pushed into your aura to connect us through time and space and limitlessness. And that's a good word for what our intention is today. Limitlessness. These symbols just kind of help me to connect with how I, I see is just these different corners of pillars in a sense of energy work. If you could, close your eyes if you're comfortable doing so and see your body sitting or laying wherever you are. See within yourself and see complete darkness. So if your body was space or just dark energy, I don't mean negative, I mean just the void where light comes forth from, where ideas and inspiration come from. Silence, focus, deep understanding, spiritual connection, peace, 
in complete connection to everything around you. Mineral, plant, animal, human, time, concepts, beliefs, practices, skills, ability, knowledge. And as you focus on the dark silhouette of your body, begin to see or notice these sparks, like maybe fireflies or fireworks, shooting stars, glitter, explosions, in your mind, flashing around different colors, different points popping off and being activated. Feel your higher self and its connection to you as if it's reaching through the top of your head in whatever visual that comes into your mind or however you see it and maybe swirling its hand <laughs> or energy around in this space down to your throat down to your heart back to your head and just swirling it around this loop or cycle of higher chakra activation. Feel this tingling sensation in your scalp, behind your eyes, maybe even in your throat. And know that your request is made, this shift is forming or underway you've successfully upgraded your mind, your consciousness, your connection to everything else and deeper understanding. And I, and I fluff your aura this gorgeous crystal blue, like aquamarine. Or celestite. Around your head, I'm going to draw or create this golden, like yellow, golden halo, you could say. A ring which heightens your your mind's ability to discern use its judgment not be um, influenced without understanding it's protective in that way and we focus on the heart keep us humble, you know. It's one thing to be highly aware and it's another thing to act like you know everything. So check in with our heart. Just make sure that we come from a good place. And as these fireworks or sparkles or whatever you see in your mind start setting off to begin to create these lights like flashlights shining from them and they begin to illuminate your entire body creating maybe new muscle connections either or muscle memory awakening parts of your body and their strengths, healing, ridding of any cold or anything that you have like that going on. Your body is hyper tapped into its own ability to heal itself. 
it spreads all down your body, all the way to the very bottom of your feet and the top of your head. And take a deep breath. Release it comfortably. And feel this, just how you feel. <laughs> feel how you feel about being this new, improved version of yourself. You can fall asleep if you'd like, of course. But do remember to give thanks for this ability to bring in this awakening kind of energy. And I don't mean be grateful to me, I mean be grateful to yourself, your higher self, and your body, and your mind, and subconsciousness, and consciousness, and everything. So, now that you're all smoothed out, Thank you so much for watching. I'm completely grateful for your love and support and for this ability to connect and be, you know, a little friendly face on your path or someone who helps you relax once in a while. <laughs> From the bottom of my heart, as always, namaste.